Vegas, Nevada. Ian Riccoboni joined by very special guest, Randy Rhodes. And Randy, you are out here tonight scouting the competition. It should be a great match. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm actually, I'm a big fan of Stella. Stella's come in, kind of like me. She's new, she's got lots to prove, and she's, she's gonna make a big impact, I, I would say. I think so, too. We'll take it to Bobby Cruz for our introduction. This is a Women of Honor Wednesday match, and it is set for one ball. Introducing Whoa. first, let's get up to Olympia, Pennsylvania, Stella Gray. You know, Stella Gray, you mentioned that she's new, she's hungry. She's a woman who had her first professional match in front of almost a capacity crowd in Concord, North Carolina, one of the biggest crowds Ring of Honor's had. So she took it right to the max, but she's going after perhaps the most decorated competitor in Women of Honor. Decorated is, uh, that, that's a nice thing to say about her. That's for sure. Her opponent, wrestling out of Cincinnati, Ohio, the gatekeeper, Kelly Klein. As she made her entrance, Brandy, we saw the juxtaposition. Wait, what is what is with these fingers? I don't know. Six, eight, eight. She's she's hung <laughs> up on this undefeated streak. You know, before we came out here, she said if she was victorious tonight, it would be 700 days undefeated. But you and I both know that she lost by count out to Karen Q in Baltimore. Yeah, everybody knows that, but you know, Kelly's just gonna deny and blame other people. That's a, that's her strategy. That's her way of trying to psych people like us out. But if we focus on what's real, which is that she is beatable, then someone like Stella or myself can absolutely take her. It's just a matter of time. Then we take you back to Atlanta in front of your friends, in front of your family. You proved there is a blueprint. You were the first person ever to, to get out of the end of the match. You found the ropes, broke the hold. So I think you're absolutely right, Brandy. I think there is a, a way to beat her. We've seen Deanna Perrazzo lock on that, that Fujiwara armbar, seemingly tapping her out. Let's see. Is she gonna, is she gonna play nice or is she gonna be her, her usual self? Avoids the code of honor. Hmm. Stella Gray, fearless. Oh! oh! Come on! Ooh. Okay, all right. Uh -oh. oh, high facing her That's again. That's her usual thing, though, you know? She likes to try to try to make you look bad for, for trying to do the match right. Look at this, goes behind, roll up one. Yeah, gotta, give, go. gotta give Stella great credit, she's not phased by this she seemingly. She doesn't look scared by her at all. Look at that wrist lock. Oh! Oh. Drives the elbow in. You know, Brandy, I'm surprised you've been, you've been kind of cordial to me. I know you're husband, <laughs> the world champion. I, I, he and I have uh, not been on great terms. Well, just join the club, because a lot of people aren't on great terms with Cody. He's a kind of a mean guy, but honestly, he's really nice to me, so I, I have no problem with him. But I understand if you do, because he, he's not the nicest. <laughs> well, I'm glad that uh, I'm glad that we got that. I was a little <laughs> nervous when I saw your name on a production sheet. Well, that's good. If you're nervous, then maybe Kelly is nervous when she sees my name up against her coming up. We'll just keep it like that. Keep it between me and you, that I'm nice. <laughs> There you go. I mean, it was a great effort in Atlanta. We saw you in that great tag team match in Concord yourself. You made your Women of Honor debut, much like Stella did. Drop kick, but dismissed a little bit, blocked by Kelly. Oh, driving the forearm in. And it's interesting because it seems like Stella is trying to keep her foot on the gas here, which takes, All right, she's yeah, takes Kelly out of her game plan a little bit. Out of okay, her element. yeah, she's she's going. So, oh, shoot, just that fast, you know. Yeah, Kelly likes to slow things down. Kelly likes to fight on her own terms. You know what? Kelly's got half makeup on. She has makeup on. I think the left side of her face and nothing on the right. What is that supposed to mean? Did she forget no, to put the rest of her makeup on? That's that's a juxtaposition. You know, she calls herself pretty badass. The, the quote -unquote. It seems pretty stupid to me. Put wow. all the makeup on or don't, you know? She also calls herself the gatekeeper. Ooh. You know, whether or not that undefeated streak was truly broken, no one has pinned or submitted the gatekeeper. Oh! 
They're just toying. Yeah, but this is how she's going to mess up. She plays games with people like myself and Stella because she underestimates us. But she's going to she's gonna trip up sooner or later, and hopefully Stella can take advantage in that moment. Oh, just disrespectful. And Brandy, you're absolutely right. Somebody's going to come along one of these days and prove to Kelly that that this way she's competing, this savoir faire, so to speak. She's, it's not going to work for everybody, for every opponent. She's going to run into the wrong woman. Maybe that woman's Stella Gray. Look at her. Stella yeah, coming right yeah. back at her. I mean, she just keeps touching people's faces, too, and that's, that's a no-go in women's wrestling. You don't want to touch a girl's face. Coming in, driving it in. Oh, listen to the thuds, Brandy. Oh, come on, Stella. You got this. Irish whip into the corner. Move, Stella. Diving oh, in. Oh, man. Oof. Full head of steam going to the top. We don't normally see Kelly go to the top. Oh! Oh, good. Ian, man. Right. I don't know. The funny thing is, is these people still cheer for her, and she is just a rancid human. Like, she's awful. You know, no disrespect meant, but the run-ins with, uh, with the world champion and I have had, you know, people still cheer for him. <laughs> I, I think it's the success. I think are you, it's... Are you calling my husband Rancid? No, I wouldn't say complete. Oh, jeez, we've got to cut that. Him, for, I'm yeah. going to tell him you said that. Let's cut that gonna from gonna the broadcast. Him, I'm going to tell him you said he was a rat. Please don't say Straight that. Straight up. Please don't say that, Brandon. I mean, <laughs> I mean, he and I have had our differences, but you know what? It's it's the money, it's the success, it's the fame. Kelly has all that, undefeated for so long. Nobody's been or submitted her, and this is this is Stella's golden opportunity, and she's yes, fighting back. She's, she's on fire at this point. Oh come on. Oh. There we go. Trying to fight this out of that. This is that moment. This yeah. is that moment. Oh, Kelly looks tired. Looking for the DDT. Countered, reversed, elbow into the sternum, and another. Uh -oh. She looks she mad. Klein line missed. Spear! Oh, all right. Spear connects. Cover her. Oh. Oh. Yikes. Not even an opportunity to go yeah. for the cover. Let's. Oh. Okay. Drives all right. It she's, down. Still got, she's still got some fight. Let's go. Here we go. Still working on Kelly. I think that's a smart Here move. Here we go. Going for the cover one. Oh. Pushes her off of her. Mm. Look at the fire. Look at the fight from Stella. Yeah, she's bringing it to her. And you know, Kelly looks really tired right now. This is an opportunity for her to take her down, show her no mercy. Countering the dragon sleeper with those knees to the head is Kelly. Yeah, she's got some knees going back. Yeah, Stella giving her right back. Drops down, drops that vertical base, blocks the suplex. And again, Klein. If Stella can pull this off, she's my hero, seriously. I'll be front page news all around the wrestling world. Yeah. Oh! Lowers oh, it to the midsection. God. And again, we rarely see Kelly go anywhere near those turnbuckles. Something well, see, new here. Well, see, she's having to pull out all the stops here. That shows that Stella is a real competitor here. She's giving it to her. Sure is. Stella fights Kelly off of the turnbuckles. Oh, oh boy. Oh, no. This isn't look good. She may have just made Kelly angry, though. Oh, man. Oh. oh. Ow. Oh. Elbows to the, to the ribs. No way. Oh, come on. Look at oh. the strength of Kelly oh, no. Klein. Oh, no. I no. can't watch this. I don't want to see it. I got to Oh, my God. Oh, he slam up the oh. second rope cover. One. What? Wow. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? She you kicked out of one, Brandy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Come on, Stella. Oh, she awoke the beast now. Oh. Okay, wait a minute now. This is getting really vicious. Cravat in the knees. Uh -oh. oh, here we go. Oh, no, okay. Turn okay. off the lights. All she's got to do is just get to those. Oh, Lock man. the door. Closing time. Wow. Kelly Klein, the end of the match. Who will know the match by submission? The gatekeeper, Kelly Klein. And there were moments in the match, Brandy, where I thought Kelly was just toying with Stella. But Stella, Stella gave her more than she bargained for. I think you're right, Brad. I think the right woman comes along. It's starting to happen more and more. And you know, I can't wait for my second chance with her because the more I watch her and see her make these critical mistakes, the more I'm learning. I just gotta hang in there with her. Oh, wait a minute, who's? Oh, wow. That's a Scarlet Bordeaux. We know Kelly and Scarlet are both headed to stardom. Yeah, yeah. 
Scarlet looking fantastic tonight. Wow. Oh, I, need to, I need to talk to her stylist. Kelly just made the signal for 700. Scarlet's got a microphone. Yeah, she's got something to say. Looks like old habits die hard, huh? Uh -oh. Look, I'm only here for one reason. In a few weeks, I'll be representing not only America and Japan, but women of honor. Yeah. And unfortunately, stardom has teamed me up with you. What? Wow. I'm not happy about it. I don't like you. And frankly, I don't even know if I can trust you. But no. I plan to make the best of it. You know, one of the things I've always respected about you is at least you've always treated me the same way to my face as behind my back, unlike half the other girls in wrestling. So we don't have to have pillow fights and braid each other's hair. We just have to put aside the pettiness long enough to win that tournament and bring back that title to America. Wow, these two will be teaming together at stardom. That, but if you screw me over, those rumors floating, out, floating around the locker room about what a crazy psycho I am, you'll find out just how crazy I can be. Ooh. No need to be so dramatic, Scarlett. My goal in stardom will be the same as it is right here. That's to win. When that meant kicking your ass, I kicked your ass. Will you remember, I, I just haven't seen you since then. <laughs> oh. If winning means protecting your ass, you know what? Just stay out of my way. Don't screw around and don't get confused because once I win, we're done. Oh, can they trust one another in Japan? These two will team up and start a brandy. I can't believe it. You know, folks, keep it locked in. ROHWrestling.com for more details on these two teaming together. What a Women of Honor Wednesday this has been. For Brandy Rhodes, I'm Ian Riccoboni. We thank you both for watching. We will see you next week. See you guys.